The other point is David had a dream. Psalm hundred forty-four, verse twelve. He dreamed of this. Verse twelve, that our sons may be as plants grown up in their youth, that our daughters may be as pillars sculptured in palace style, that our barns may be full, supplying all kinds of produce, that our sheep may bring forth thousands and ten thousands in our fields, that our oxen may be well laden. That there be no breaking in or going out, that there be no outcry in our streets. Happy are the people who are in such a state. Happy are the people whose God is the Lord. What was David dreaming of? He eagerly desired the world where God rules to come. That our sons may be as choice plants grown up in their youth. That means the born again children and sons are grown up in their youth as plants. That our daughters may be as pillars sculptured in palace style, which means the children are born again and used by God. That our barns may be full, supplying all kinds of produce. That our sheep may bring forth thousands and ten thousands in our fields, that our oxen may be well laden, that there be no breaking in or going out. He longed for a united nation, where there is no war, no outcry in their streets, where the Lord rules, and for Israel to be stable and for God's name to be glorified all over the world. Because he had such an earnest desire, God trained him. John Wesley said, "The world is my parish." He eagerly desired to to spread the gospel to people all over the world. What was Jesus' dream when he came to the world? His dream was that many people are saved through his death. Himself being a grain of wheat, our earnest desire is that more people are saved. People in our generation don't really have a dream, but after we got salvation, we have a dream. I want to save my family. I want to save more souls. David had a dream. The Bible says that because he experienced God, he wanted the entire people of Israel to know Him, and that every time the people gathered, he proclaimed the good news of righteousness. And in many places in the Bible, he eagerly desired not only Israel but also the whole world to know and serve the Lord. We have a desire, because we are saved. We have this hope. That a lot more people will be saved.